Hey friends and welcome back to my channel. My name is Annalise and not too long ago I posted a video on my channel where I tried on all of my high heels and the top comment on that video was to try on all of the clothes that I own. So that is what I am doing today. Now I am a bit of a shopaholic as you guys would know if you watch my channel. I love clothes, I love fashion, so as such I have quite a lot of clothes. So this is going to be a multiple part video. Today is just part one because if I did all, if I tried on all of my clothes in one video it would literally be like 42 hours long so in today's video I'm gonna be trying on all of my dresses all of my two pieces and all of my lounge wear to share with you guys and then part two should be up within a few days where I try on the rest of my clothes so don't worry you won't have to wait long for part two at all so without further ado let's just get on into it welcome to my closet to kick off this video I'm gonna be trying on all of my dresses I'm gonna kick it off with a pink dress of course it's this gorgeous one from Meshki I actually have a one yeah, it still has the tags attached, but I'm pretty sure that I like this, so let's put it on. And this is what the dress looks like on, and I really like it. This is definitely staying. It still has the tags on it because I haven't worn it yet, but that's because I bought this during quarantine. I got it on eBay for super cheap, which was amazing, and I haven't had a chance to wear it out yet, but I do have a 21st coming up soon. Finally, I'm so excited, so I think I might wear this dress. The only issue is, is that it's completely backless, and I don't have one of those fancy schmancy bras that, like, is just stick on on the front so I will have to get one of those but I love this this is staying so what's next I might actually try on all of my pink dresses first just for something fun so next up I have this dress that is a two-piece which is super cute so let's put this on now this dress I knew I was gonna keep because I love it this is from Fashion Nova and I love it it's so cute because it has a little matching jacket so in the summertime I would just wear this pink dress as like an easy lazy day outfit like if I'm going out somewhere nice but don't want to really put together an outfit it's perfect and now that it's cooler I'm gonna start wearing this again with the jacket because the weather's warming up a little bit here like we're leaving winter going into summer so this is gonna be the perfect little outfit it does have a lot of stains on it from me so I actually might have to wash this even though these are obviously all clean hanging up in my closet it has been sitting in there for a few months unworn so yeah I might need to wash this again but apart from that I like it so moving on the next pink dress I have is this one here that I am keeping I already know I'm keeping honestly pink dresses I'm probably gonna keep them all because hello it's me I'm gonna wear them but this one is beautiful I haven't worn it in ages because the clubs have been closed I haven't had anywhere to wear it but let's put it on this is what the dress looks like on and I flipping adore this dress so it's from misguided I actually wore this on New Year's Eve that was the last time I wore it when the clubs open this is definitely being worn it's so flipping cute I love it it's so girly and oh, this is probably my favorite dress that I own. Will I say that 10 times in this video? Yes, but how about it's the favorite pink dress that I own? So let's try on another pink one. Or we have, sometimes because I have too many clothes in my closet, I do have to double up items on hangers. So we won't try on this red one just yet, but we will try on this gorgeous pink dress from Meshki. This is the first dress that I think I'm going to have to get rid of because if I turn around, y'all can see that this doesn't do up. You know, I've gained some weight during quarantine. I think a majority of us have. So as such, some of my clothes don't fit like they used to which is totally fine so I'm going to sell this on Depop because it's a gorgeous dress I love it but it ain't gonna work for me it's just not gonna work so moving on to another pink dress we have this super cute tweed one that I'm going to try on this dress is staying I love tweed as you guys know and I just love this dress so much I actually got it in Paris I believe it's just from Topshop but I did get it at Topshop in Paris so I'm definitely keeping it for that reason because who knows when the heck we'll be able to travel again and I'll be able to get back to Paris so this one is saying it's a gorgeous little day dress that I wear out with sneakers or I could dress it up with heels which I love how whimsical is this dress I love it so very much I feel like I need to go on some sort of picnic in this dress I love it so this is definitely staying however one dress that I think I'm gonna get rid of is this next pink dress so I have these maxi dresses in the pink color and then again in the olive green and I don't know it might be time for these to leave let me try them on this is what the dress looks like on and yes it's pretty but it's just not something that I would wear so I think it'll be better off in someone else's home you know I was just gonna say yeah same with the green one as well better off in someone else's home but now that I have it on I don't know if it'd be better off in someone else's home I think it deserves to stay in my home so I think I'm actually gonna keep this one just because I love this color I don't really own much else in this green color except for this dress here so we'll try this on next because we have gone through all of my pink dresses so let's throw on this little green number I really was planning on keeping this dress but uh I think it needs to go to someone else because this does not 
fit me. <laughs> when did that happen? This is literally my go-to clubbing dress. I love it so much, but uh, apparently it no longer loves me. So let's move on to something else before I focus on the fact that my favorite dress doesn't fit me anymore. And let's try on this tweed dress. There is truly nothing on this planet like a good tweed dress to make you feel good about yourself. <laughs> so I am obsessed with this dress. I think it's beautiful, very Parisian-esque, and I'm pretty sure it was super cheap as well because it was from Shein, so it must have been cheap. So I love this so much. I feel much better because I'm actually gutted that that green dress doesn't fit me. I'm like, buy a lot. I don't know. I don't know how that happened. I really don't. It's kind of stressing me out. But I love this dress. Glad that this still fits me because I am obsessed with this. So next dress we're gonna try on is this blue dress. Now I recently wore this. Not recently. <laughs> Before the pandemic, I wore this to a friend's 21st birthday, and I got a lot of compliments on it. So let's see if this still fits because apparently every dress that I like doesn't fit me. I am happy to report that this dress still fits because I love this so very much and would have been gutted if it doesn't. It's beautiful. I love this color and it's very Alice in Wonderland-esque and it's literally from Fashion Nova. I think it was pretty cheap as well and I've gotten so many wears out of this. And next let's put on another favorite of mine. This dress is another go-to clubbing dress from Pretty Little Things. Let's throw it on. This dress is a must-have for any of my guys and gals out there that like to wear dresses and like to go out because it's such a fun dress yet it's still like a plain black dress. So this is my version of an LBD. Everyone always says you need a little black dress in your closet but I personally don't think you need a plain basic black dress in your closet. Have a black dress but have it be something fun like this with the lace detail, the corset detail, the sheer sleeves. I love this. I always pick it out if I don't know what to wear out clubbing because it's such a gorge outfit that is very easily put together. So I definitely recommend this one. It's gorge but moving on we have a whole rack of dresses to try on here so I think I'm gonna get started with these. Starting off with this black dress that was on that coat hanger it's this beautiful feather boa top that I think this is another great version of an LBD so it's a little black dress but it's not boring because it has the feathers so this actually came a lot longer and in a previous video I was like that's it I'm getting rid of it I never wear it that weekend I cut it short and I wore it so <laughs> I think this is gonna stay because every time I think I'm gonna get rid of this dress it crawls right back into my closet but the next dresses I'm gonna try on I have two of the same color because as I can't remember who said this maybe Carrie Bradshaw once said if you like something buy it in every color so I bought these in two colors the first color that I have this dress in is red and I love this I've worn it so many times it's just a basic little red insta baddie dress I got this from Meshki and of course I got it in another color orange and honestly after trying these on again I think I'm gonna get these in even more colors because they're just such great basic outfits for the summer and I wear them literally all the time and they fit me really well so they're both from Meshki and I think I might be getting some more when summer comes back around so next dress that we have is the last one on this hanger and it is a beautiful satin dress that looks kind of funky so let's put this on this dress is another fave of mine because it has a tie up satin feature at the back which really makes me look like I have a bit of a waist which y'all know I do not so this dress is from Amazon I love it so much so it's definitely staying as well I also don't own many dresses in this color actually I don't think I own any other dresses in this color so this is definitely staying I love it so moving on another dress that I have here is just a classic denim let's put this on this is what the little denim number looks like on so this is the front and this is the back and it's a great dress I, it's from forever 21 I wear it all the time so I'm gonna keep this one as well but moving on I'm going through this quite quickly just because I don't want this video to be boring of me like yakking for so long in my dresses so moving on the next one we have is another one that I usually wear at home a lot but I think it's time to get rid of it so let me put it on this is what the dress looks like on so this is the front and this is the back and the reason I said that I want to get rid of it is because it's literally falling to pieces originally it had a cute little bow tie up detail on the front here that's fallen off it now has a hole in the side I sewed it up but that's come undone and it's falling apart again so this is literally like falling to pieces as I wear it. It's a couple of years old now, so I think that it might be time for me to try and do a DIY on this dress instead of continuing to wear it until inevitably one day it just falls to pieces. So I think that this I can just use the scraps. And same with this dress here. I'm not even going to try this on because it's so broken. The strap here snapped one day while I was having a nap. <laughs> really rigorous activity there, but I tried to fix it and it just wouldn't fix. So I think that this can go in my scrap pile 
pile. That way I can use these fabrics for DIYs, fun things like that. That way they're not being wasted. So that's where these will go. Which brings us to the second last dress in this video. This is like brand new, only from a few videos ago. And it's from Princess Polly. So I'm going to throw this on. This is what the dress looks like on. And this was picked out by Taylor in a recent video. So I'm definitely going to keep this. I also haven't had a chance to wear it anyway yet. So I'm going to keep this. But we are moving on to the lucky last dress in this video and I say dress with like the bunny ears because it is a blazer dress and I haven't worn this out anywhere yet because I haven't had anyone wear it too but I really want to so let me show y'all what this looks like on is this not the cutest outfit ever so this is the front and this is the back and I just flipping adore this blazer dress as I said I haven't worn it out anywhere yet because I haven't had anywhere to wear it to thanks Miss Rona but I started with a belt and I just think it'd be so cute I might actually look cuter if I rolled up the sleeves a little bit oh I mean there we go it's a fit it's a fit huns and I love this so much so this is definitely staying I will not be parting with this but with that that's actually the last dress that I own all right so that is me trying on every single dress I own and in the end I'm keeping them all except for five two I'm going to use as scraps and three I'm going to sell on my depot because they're gorgeous dresses that I just no longer need but moving on from dresses I am now going to try on my two pieces all my sets and if you are a returning subscriber you would know that I am obsessed with sets so I have quite a few pairs to try on these are all of the two pieces that I own so I'm going to be trying them all on seeing what ones I want to keep and seeing what ones I want to get rid of although I kind of think I'm going to want to keep them all since I have quite a lot of two-piece sets I'm going to do this in some sort of order so I'm going to kick this off by trying on my two-piece sets that are a top and a skirt kicking it off with this gorgeous little blue one Ta -da! this is what the first set looks like on so this is the front and this is the back and I really really love this set I think it's so very cute but when I got this in a haul a lot of you guys told me that it's actually really see-through and I didn't notice that at the time but looking now I like yeah I wouldn't be comfortable wearing this out because it is so see-through which sucks because it's such a gorgeous piece but unfortunately I am not going to keep this and I'm going to get rid of it it's also not going to go on my Depop because I'm not going to sell something that's see-through so <sighs> that sucks but let's move on to something that is not going to be see through this cute little set this next set is super duper cute this is from aliexpress and it's kind of old i've had it for a while now but it's kind of been timeless because these knit pieces were in at the time that i got it probably like 2017 i want to say and they are still in now because maybe not 2017 that's a bit much maybe like 2018 but they're still in now and i love this i'm gonna keep it again this is something that i literally forgot that i owned because it had been in a drawer for a long time and i forgot about it but I definitely think I'm gonna whip it out again soon because it's quite a thick knit material so it means that it's too hot to wear in summer but right about now where the weather's starting to warm up a little bit I think this would be perfect so I'm definitely going to keep this moving on to another set that I'm not too sure I don't know if I'll keep this one or not so we're gonna have to try it on and see this is the set so this is from Shein and this is the front this is the back and I know I said I wasn't sure if I'm gonna keep it and I'm still not but I'm thinking for now I will keep this it's just because it's difficult to like know what I want to wear the next season because I'm thinking I'll keep this for summer when I'm able to wear it again but like when summer comes will I actually wear this I don't know it just depends on the vibe I'm feeling in summer but I do love this print and I think it's really cute so I'm gonna hold on to it for now and decide at a later date if I'm gonna keep this or not but another set that is very summery that I really hope that I wear this year because this is some this next set is one that I got in winter and was like I will wear that in summer summer came around and I did not wear it so let's see what this looks like on ta-da this is the cute summer set so when I said that I didn't wear this last summer I thought it's not exactly true because I wore these shorts with a white bodysuit so often but I actually kind of forgot about this top and oh my gosh my eyelash is falling into my eye but I forgot about this top and as such I didn't really wear it so I'm hoping this summer that I will wear this outfit because this even with like a denim jacket is super cute like it's a cute little fit but this is the last set that is like a top and bottom the rest are all jackets and skirts so I'm gonna try these on all with a plain white bodysuit first of all let's try on this clueless vibes outfit this is what the set looks like on and I think that I might get rid of this it's super cute super clueless vibes but I kind of feel that it looks a little bit too much like a costume I don't know I haven't worn it it's just stayed in my closet forever so I think it might be time to say goodbye to this piece I'm obsessed with this this is staying in my closet for many many years to come because it's just so much fun and I love it so if you watch the video where I got this you'd know that I actually 
only got this because I wanted the blazer and I really didn't care about the pants. But when the pants showed up, I actually fell in love with it as a set. So I'm really happy with this. And this is definitely saying. But moving on to another pants set that I have. It is this beautiful, amazing, gorgeous tie-dye piece. That was a bit much, Annie. That was a bit much. But it's a cute set, so I'm going to try this on too. This is another set that makes me feel like a boss babe, just because, I don't know, blazer sets just do that, and I love this so much. Moving on to another pantsuit set. This is the final pants set that I have. I've had this for quite some time, and I think it might be time to get rid of it. So let's go try it on. This is what the set looks like on, and it's a little tight on me. So this is the front. This is the back. It's from the Amber Shoal and Meshki collection that's, I think, a couple of years old now. So I've only worn this once out of the entire time of me owning it. So I definitely think that this can go on to someone else that'll appreciate it a lot more. Because if someone has, like, a vintage style, this would be perfect for them. But I don't really wear it all too often, so it's time for someone else to have it. But a set that I love and definitely don't want to pass on is this next piece because it is tweed. And I am obsessed with tweed. Anything tweed, it's with me for life. For life. Do you see what I mean? Do you see what I mean? A good tweed set is just amazing. I absolutely love this. It's only new, so again, I haven't worn this out yet. I feel like I'm saying that for a lot of these items, but it's because of coronavirus. Like, nowhere's really open fully yet, so I haven't been going out as much. But when everything opens up again, I will definitely be wearing this super gorgeous tweed set. I love it so very much. It's beautiful, it's comfy, it's chic, and I'm just obsessed with it. If I could wear tweed 24-7, I would. I mean, no, I wouldn't, because I can wear tweed 24-7. I'm an adult. I can do what I want and I don't but you know what I mean I just love it so much it's such a gorgeous outfit and I am obsessed but another outfit that I am obsessed with is this pink set that again I completely forgot about until I wore it on the weekend so let's pop this on and this is the gorge pink set so this is the front and this is the back so this is from yes style and I love it so much I would kind of like I am considering just doing a quick DIY where I make it a little bit shorter because I feel like that's for me but I wore it on the weekend out like this and I actually got a few compliments on it so I love this so much it's a gorgeous little set and I just adore it I just love sets so much there's not much I can really say for these other than I flipping love them. So actually, I was going to do this, but I have another pink set. So let's try this one on next because pink is my favorite color, as y'all can tell. So let's put this one on. This is what the set looks like on, and I love this so very much. I actually bought this again when I was in London. I go to London quite a lot before Corona because my family lives there. So I bought this then, and I am so glad that I bought this. It was literally two, almost three years ago now that I bought this and I still wear it all the time because it's just a gorgeous little denim set and I definitely recommend getting yourself a denim set in your favorite color. Maybe that's yellow, blue, orange, anything like that. It is such a good item to own and you'll get so many wears out of it. So this piece was from Topshop. I don't know if Topshop's gone out of business. I heard rumors about it, but I don't really know. I didn't really keep up with it. So if Topshop is still a thing, then I definitely recommend getting a set like this. It's just so cute and I love it. So next up, let's move on to the second last set, which is a complete opposite to this because it's fully black. And this is what the black set looks like on. I actually wear this jacket by itself all the time so much so that my girlfriend is sick of seeing it like i wear it constantly whereas this skirt i don't wear all too much but i mean recently my favorite black leather mini skirt not actual leather faux leather mini skirt broke so this might become something that i wear quite a lot i actually kind of forgot about this so i'm really glad that i have that but i love this set so much especially this jacket is just so very comfortable so this set's from misguided and it's definitely staying <laughs> and we are now on to the final set, which I also think is going to stay because I kind of love sets. But this is the final set that I'm going to try on today because it's the final set that I own. I don't know why I worded it like that, but this is the last one. So let's put it on. So instead of being a two-piece, this is actually a three-piece, but I love it nonetheless. It is super cute and I get so many wears out of this. I only got it recently in a video, I think it was like where I bought uh, clothes recommended to me on TikTok or something like that. And I got this then and I literally have not stopped wearing it since. Not only is it super cute, but it is so very comfortable. So I'm definitely not parting with this one. Alright, those are all of the sets that I own. I actually did get rid of quite a few pairs, which is good. But moving on, that is pretty much everything. Well, it is everything in this wardrobe for now that we're going to try on. So we're going to move into this 
section here to move on to the next category for this video. That is trying on all of my loungewear. So I never really bought any loungewear before the pandemic because I never really was home, never really needed like loungewear until the pandemic hit and I was like, all right, I have no comfy clothes. I need to fix that. So first of all, I mean, this is the first set. I love this so much. It's from Fashion Nova. I wear it all the time and it is so great to wear when working from home. So in these drawers, I have some outfits that I am going to share with you guys, like all of my loungewear sets. So let's get to it. Another set that I love is this one here. It says spoiled on the top and it also says it on the bottoms here. And I love this so much. It's going to be great. Well, actually for right now, because the weather is heating up a little bit, but it's still a little bit chilly. So this is perfect. And I love it so much. This is another loungewear set that I have, but I actually don't wear it all too often because I hate this top. It is so tight around the neck and I always just feel like I'm suffocating when I wear it. So I think I might get rid of this top, but I'm definitely going to keep the tracksuit pants because, oh, they don't have any pockets. That's disappointing. <laughs> but apart from not having any pockets, they are super comfy. I also have the same pair of tracksuit pants in pink because they are super comfy and I usually just pair it with a white bodysuit like this. So I only have one other piece of loungewear apart from these. And it is this super oversized long sleeve dress. It says, what does it say? No pictures please. And it is just so comfortable to wear around the house. I do not wear this out and about because it does not look flattering on me at all, but this is the most comfortable object to wear when you're just staying home, having a movie day, anything like that. But with that, that is all of the loungewear that I own. As I said, not very much because I really didn't wear loungewear before the pandemic. So now I have a few key items that I just wear constantly and I love them all. And that is part one of me trying on all of my clothes. What did you guys think? Be sure to subscribe so that you don't miss out on part two, which will be up in the next few days. And if you can't wait until then and you want to see even more content, I have been vlogging with my girlfriend on TikTok, if that's something that you're interested in. I'll have it linked on the screen right now with all of my other social medias and also linked down below. And that is all for today's video. I love you guys so, so much and I will see you next time. Bye. Mwah.